Hello everyone, welcome to the first lecture of the Full Scratch 3.0 course, which is a great primer for anyone looking to get into computer programming. Now there's a lot of places to start, and there's all these different languages and all this terminology that's being thrown around, but that's okay if you're not sure where to start yet, because this course starts at the very absolute lowest point and builds up a cumulative knowledge. And in fact, I'll take you from beginner to expert in one category of programming known as block-based programming, where you can drag and drop functions together to create scripts inside of classes while building up knowledge of universal concepts and programming vocabulary and computer logic that you'll need for whichever direction you choose to take programming if you choose to uh, continue your programming career after this course. For example, let's say you wanted to get into game development or app development or web development or whatever it be, you'll be ready with all these universal concepts and programming functions and methods that you'll need to know anyways. So even if this course doesn't it starts at the lowest level, you'll still have all that knowledge ready for whenever you take programming to a very advanced level, and you're still going from beginner to expert in the specific category of programming known as block-based programming again. And we're going to be using an engine called Scratch, more specifically Scratch 3.0, which is run and maintained by MIT or Massachusetts Institute of Technology. And they've been working on this for if not 10 years, then over 10 years. And you can do it from your browser. All you need is an internet connection, a personal computer. And the best part is it's completely free and there's no software or downloads required for any part of this course or for doing anything that we're going to be doing. And you can follow along even if you don't have an account, although I would recommend creating one. So in our next lecture, we'll actually get started with creating an account, but I'm gonna show you the website real quickly. So I have my web browser here. I'm gonna be using Google Chrome. The operating system I'm going to be using is Windows 10 Pro. However, the operating system doesn't matter and the web browser doesn't matter as long as it's not too outdated to where it can't run this site. So I'm going to go to Scratch dot mit dot edu so that's scratch s c r a t c h dot mit dot edu i'll just hit enter on my keyboard and go to the site So we're going to create an account in the next lecture, but at the bottom of the page there's some legal documents such as terms of use and privacy policy, a parents guide, and things like that. So if you're interested in looking at that before we do anything with creating an account, feel free to do that. But I'll see you guys in the next lecture where we go ahead and create that account. Alright, see you guys.